Hello guys, this is Star City Sports and today we just got some news like about 10 minutes ago that ex-cub Jose Quintana signs with the Angels and Joe Manning gets his former player that they traded for and he traded for at the Cubs in 2017 to now 20. He played for them and they got he they picked him up in free agency for a one year deal. I don't know how much but one year deal, I just saw it on Sports Center and I didn't know if that was true or not. And then I looked it up and then my local news NBC channel, when I looked up deal, it said like one year deal, he signed for it, I don't know how much. But he signed for it a year, let me see, he signed one year, eight million, eight million dollars. So, Halos, H-A-L-O-S, we just deal with Katana. He's going to the Angels. The Angels are going to be really good next year. Let me show you guys the stats he had. So in the Cubs, he didn't really play last year. He played like maybe one or two games last year. So last year he played four games but didn't do anything. He was trash last year because he didn't do anything. He was injured. So he played for the White Sox in 12-16. to 16, Then 17 at Toronto. And then went back to the Cubs in 17. And then White Sox 17. Then he went to the Cubs in 17. And then from 17 to 20, he played with the Cubs. Four years with the Cubs, not even a season with the Toronto team. So he went 33 and 23 with the Cubs. 0.589 win loss, 4.24 ELA, um, 4.24 ELA, 82 games, 78 started, zero games finished, one clean game. Meaning that I think the clean game was his first game when he played with the Cubs against the Baltimore Orioles. But I think that was when Orioles had nobody in the stands. I think when they had like nobody in the stands or whatever and he started pitching because whatever happened in Baltimore, the guy dying. I think that was this game. I don't remember. I know he played in Baltimore when he first pitched when the Cubs first got him in 17 and they won that game. He played really good. Um, One shutout. No saves, four, 439.2 innings picks, 435 hits, 223 runs, 207 ELA, 55 home runs, 138 walks, attentional baseballs with six, 420 with strikeouts, 13 hit by pitch, zero box, 16 whip, 1,871 Banners faced. EOA plus was 847. No, 110 was EOA plus. Fielding independent pitching was 110. 3.64 was in our uh, fielding independent side. Uh, walks plus hits, innings pitched was 1.266. 8.8 hits per nine. How much per nine was 0 0.9, 0 0.9. Walks per nine was two, one, yeah, 2.8. No, how much per nine was 1.1. 8.9 was hits per nine. 8.6 was strikeouts per nine, and then strikeouts with strikeouts slash W or strikeouts per walk. Or 3.10. Or 3.04, sorry. 3.04. So Katana with the Cubs. Got no walls, got nothing. Did decent with the Cubs. He was 33 and 23 with the National League team. And then he was 15 54 with the American League. Only played about 32 games with the Domin uh, Toronto team. 18. With the White Sox and 14 with the Cubs. So I was at work. My boy wasn't working with me yet. He was working with his uncle, my uncle, during that time. And then this one kid that's a huge Cubs fan. That's all he likes. He wears Cubs like hats, sweatshirts. Talk about Cubs. That's all he talks about mostly is the Cubs. <laughs> and we, my brother and him we used to like, just talk every day about the Cubs, 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 everything. Even when they're on, they talk about it and stuff like that. And he was the one that told me was, oh, hey, you're a Cubs fan, right? Yeah. We just, you guess we just got Katana. And I was like, cool, that's a good pickup. And then now that's a trash pickup because of who they gave up. 
<laughs> they give up Jimenez and everything, so I'm really mad. But you know what? I gotta see a lot of different teams this year. I gotta see Angels play, I gotta see Katana and Joe Manning's team play. I gotta see the Padres with a lot of teams. So I'll tell you guys a schedule of what I'll be doing this summer, this whole baseball season, and what I'll be doing. But this guys, Jose Katana goes to the White Sox, no, the Angels for one year, $8 million. I think that's a steal for the Angels because of didn't do anything for the Cubs. Cubs let him go, and it's like Angels need pitching, starting pitching, so that's a good pickup. Everyone on the radio is like, how about the White Sox pick up, get Katana again? Then can use him and then find someone else, like Dylan Cease to do good. So like, huh, well, anyways, guys, kind of check, guys, what do you guys think of the Angels picking up Katana for one million, eight, one year, eight million dollars. I think that's a good deal for him. I wish the Cubs kept him because the Cubs need pitching because they lost Darvish for trade. They lost Rester, Chatwood, and Katana. So that's back for four stunning pitchers right there. So all we have now is the guy they got from the Padres that played for the Brewers. They have Alec Mills, Hendricks, Alzalei. A couple other guys on the backups, but I don't know. I don't know. Anyways, guys, what do you guys think of Katana going to the Angels for one year, $8 million? Comment in the chat. Comment in the section below. This is Shy Space Podcast. See you guys in the next video. I'll uh, be signing out. Peace.